iCountry is brought to you by enjoytravel.co.uk music and dancing holidays. Good evening, you're very welcome to this week's I Country with myself, Jared Butler. And yours truly, Brendan McGee. And yet another week has rolled by and we're getting closer to a certain date as well, which is what? Valentine's Day. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you've oh. heard of that, haven't you? Yep. Well, the girls love Valentine's Day. They do. And we have everything planned, haven't we? We don't. <laughs> <laughs> Not you as well. No. No. Happy Valentine's Day to our wives. Yes, honey, hi. That's that sorted. All right, okay. That was the cheapest Valentine's Day ever. Well, it's cheaper than last year. <laughs> anyway, kicking off the show tonight, we have three fantastic singers. We have a Sligo man, we have a Mullingar, Louisiana man, and we have a Limerick man. Of course, together they are called the Three Amigos. Still not dead. I woke up still not dead again today. The internet said I had passed away. But if I die, I wasn't dead to stay And I woke up still not dead again today But I woke up still not dead again today The gardener didn't find me that way You can't believe a word that people say And I woke up still not dead again today Patrick, Jimmy and Robert there, the three amigos, a fantastic act and of course uh, just after finishing a concert tour and packed houses everywhere again. Yeah, did you get a chance to see them this time around? I did indeed, they were brilliant. Yeah, I see them as well and you know what, you could go back time after time. Definitely, yeah. a very funny show as well, comedy. There's a bit of, yeah, a bit like ourselves. Oh yeah, I tell you, they'll be taking us on next, <laughs> they'll want us. <laughs> Talking about a guy who puts a bit of comedy into, of course, Seamus Moore. Brilliant, that. Brilliant man from Kilkenny, show. he's been living in London now for God knows how long and you know what, I came across an old brochure or a kind of a, a tour brochure of Seamus Moore. It must be dating back to the late 90s. And I had pictures of him. He was a he was a doorman in the Gresham in London. That's right, I heard that. Yeah. I used to turn used to turn the, the, the table stage as well. The stage, well yeah. that was was that the Galti or the Gresham? I'm not sure. I'm not yeah, sure because I'm, sure I'm only a young oh, fellow. Yeah. I've only heard of these places. We had photographs of Brendan O'Brien from the Dixies with uh, Dickie Rock, with Joe Dolan and with Brendan Boyer and um, 
that's a bit of nostalgia there. Of but course, of course, yeah. he comes over to Ireland every so often. He does a marathon tour during the summer. I think he could do 90 nights on the trot and more, not take a break. More on tour or, some, or something like that. Something like that. Yeah, there's a word missing there, but we'll yeah. leave it out as well. That's missing. <laughs> but anyway, here is Seamus. It was a huge hit in the summer of last year. It's one called The Mighty Man from Mayo. I live on the farm three miles from Kilkelly Talking to myself, living on my own. I took out a single ad in the Farmer's Journal And another one on Midwest Radio I'm a mild man or middle-aged mighty man from Mayo Living a quiet life out in the country I'm six foot two, never drank a drop of water But I'm looking for love, some female company First to call was Mary from Bohola Pretty as a picture, a lady so refined Well, I took her for a spin on me Honda 15 And I sure as hell haven't seen her for a while Well, the next to call was Eileen from Dahoma Looking like a model, very tall and thin I asked her would she help me clean the hen house I never ever ever saw her again I'm a mild man or middle aged mighty man from AO Living a quiet life out in the country I'm six foot three and I drink a drop of porter I'm looking for love some female company Now then, girls, what about this? Having we an ad in here from a mild-mannered, middle-aged, mighty man from Mayo looking for love. One fine day with Catty down from Partry. Billy the Gold, he really took a shine. Well, he chased her all the way to Knock Airport I never really got a chance to say goodbye The last girl I met was Margaret from my Gauna And things are going really, really slow I still have the ad in the Farmer's Journal and the other with Claffy on Midwest Radio I'm a mild-mannered, middle-aged, mighty man from Mayo Living a quiet life out in the country I'm six foot four and I drink a lot of porter I'm looking for love, some female company I'm a mild-mannered, middle-aged, mighty man from Mayo Living a quiet life out in the country I'm six foot five and I drink a rake of water I'm looking for love, some female company And I'm looking for love, some female company Well, that was a great crack in that video, wasn't it? The mighty man from Mayo, Seamus Moore, and of course from Kilkenny. And uh, he's, he's, he's busy boy, ploughing championships. That's right. Listoon Varna. And he actually came up with us recently and he sang a few songs with us in the McWilliam Park Hotel in Clare Morris. He has a great beat, actually, to his recordings. There's something, There's a nice I don't know what he has, yeah. he's, he's unique. He is, he has a nice you groove. Know, and he's a great following as well. He has indeed. And talking about the mighty man from Mayo, a mighty man from Mayo by the name of Jerry Guthrie, has recorded this great song. You're going to enjoy it. Story of a little country boy. He was always happy 
am full of joy There's nothing in this world That he's thinking of All he really cares for Is the one he loves And the moon above Stars above Heaven above That is all he's thinking of Have you heard the story Of a little country girl She was always happy in her country world All she ever wanted To fill her heart with joy Was to meet and fall in love With a little country boy And the moon above Stars above Heaven above That is all he's thinking of Now you've heard my story Darling, can't you see, can't you see? That the little country boy to be me That she loved him too Now you've heard my story Darling, can't you see That the little country boy Happens to be me And the moon above Stars above Heaven above That is all he's thinking of Now you've heard my story Darling, can't you see iCountry is brought to you by enjoytravel.co.uk music and dancing holidays. Welcome back to part two of this week's iCountry. And uh, part one was good and some more great tracks coming up in part two, three and four of the show this week. And once again, a huge thank you to all the people who've got in touch with us via the website and via Facebook and everything. And we're delighted with the response we're getting on the program. It's brilliant. Yes, yeah, brilliant. And we're getting loads of likes on our Facebook page. So if you haven't already gone on to our Facebook or our Instagram, make sure you get on there. Of course, it's iCountry TV on Facebook and Instagram. There's great videos and there's great videos, and this is certainly a great video. It's from a young lady originally from Bonnie, Scotland, and uh, living in County Fermanagh now, Lisa McHugh. Mm -hmm. And here she is, and it's one called The Girl with, with the fish. fish and Rod. Fish and 
Lisa McHugh there and the girl with the fishing rod. And did you ever do much fishing in your time, Jared? Years ago, some float fishing, but all you ever caught was the cold. <laughs> Good enough for you. <laughs> that was it. Do you know what a tang is? I didn't know what a tang was until I'd done an outside broadcast at uh, the Full of the Pipe truck show in Cavan a few years ago. Right, okay. And they were talking about this tang and that tang, and I, I had to ring the wife to find out what a tang was, because she has a brother who sells trucks. Right. And he'd know all what a tang was, so yeah. I was told a tang is a man that drives a truck. Or maybe a woman. A tang -ess. A tang -ess. I don't know. That could be a new word. That could be. For the Oxford English Dictionary. Mm -hmm. There you go. Anyway, over to you. Talking about tangs, of course, uh, here's a man that has recorded this song called Tangs Hollen. He's from Pettigo in the county of Donegal. Great man and a great singer and a great entertainer, Paul Kelly. Pushing for the boat, Maggie on the box, Wasp on the bridge, boats at the docks. Queen Tang, she's on the rear, boy, she's some bit of gear. Be parked up soon at Mazarlin, rear on diesel and the country king. Tang's a hauling, sea beast crawling, trucking, looking, girls are looking. Lights, pipes, jewel brights, rebel popping through the night. Hauling cows, sheep or donkeys, mountain dew, beer or monkeys. Can you have all the milk or dab? Nipples reach on the old right shaft. Big ten four, keep her lit. Fully loaded, we'll get her yet. From the 75, giving her socks. Take the bumps and ride the knobs. White line fever gets me down. Hands pushing, making ground. Through the gears, smoke the road. Poke the power and tip the load. Donkeys, mountain dew, beer or monkeys Can you have all the milk or daft? Nipples, grease, all the old right shaft And in the door, they skip cars at the orchard run. And shields bar, there'll be some fun. Flash me lights, blow the horn. God bless the day the truck was born. Hands on, see these calling, trucking, looking, girls are looking. Lights, pipes, chew a bright, rebel popping through the night. Hauling cows, sheep or donkeys, mountain dew, beer or monkeys. Can you have a little burp or dab? Nipples, grease on the old drive shaft. Kelly there, of course, and Tang's hauling for all you truck drivers out there. And I seen a program on the TV a few months ago and about a truck show, and I can't believe the lengths that people go to get their trucks just looking so brilliant. The, the painting, the chrome, the polishing. Everything. It's incredible, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, there's a pride, pride of place for some people. It's just unbelievable. And they arrive on site at these truck shows and they just spend the whole day polishing their trucks and just making sure the chrome is shining. And, it's, and there was it's trophies fantastic. and everything. There was different categories oh, and classes. It's, it's a huge thing, huge. There's probably a truck show probably every second or third week. 
Is there? All over the country. There's huge truck shows all over the UK as well. It's a funny just, I suppose, because we're not in the scene, we just don't know about it. Yeah, I've, I've been lucky enough now to be involved uh, with doing a few broadcasts, outside right. broadcasts from Full of the Pipe. It's a truck show that takes place in Punchestown. Oh, right, okay. And it's fantastic. You should go along sometime. That's punch the race course down the near Kildare course, or yeah, down yeah. in Yeah, and there's just oh. a thousand trucks there. Wow. All polished. We'll definitely have to make that a yeah. port of call this year. Um, Dominic Kerwin, what we can say about that man, he's, he's been around for a while now and I'm not saying you're old Dominic, but he's certainly, he's got great experience and he's well loved all and over. a huge fan base all over and I've worked with Dominic on a few cruises and a few right. trips to the UK and he's just a gentleman to deal with. Yeah, gentleman. and I've, I've, I've interviewed him a few times, it's funny how the first time I ever met Dominic Kerwin, I used to play in a rock band at school, I was right. to St Michael's in Enniskillen and we had a, a rock band called Into the Exit, right? And we went, we entered a competition in Oma, and it was for, um, the prize was to win uh, a single recorded in a proper recording studio. And of course we got to the, the final, and who was in the final? Dominic Kerwin and ourselves. And Dominic got first, and we got second. Very good. So I didn't like Dominic for a long time. <laughs> you got over it. <laughs> I got over it. <laughs> but anyway, here is Dominic Kerwin. A great video to this one too. It's one called, Write This Down. I never saw the end inside Fools are kind of blind Thought everything was going all right But I was running out of time Cause you had one foot out the door I swear I didn't see But if you really go in a way Here's some final words from me Baby, write this down Take a little note you didn't know Tell yourself I love you And I don't want you to go Write this down Take my words Read them every day Keep them close by Don't you let them fade away So you remember what I forgot to say Write this down Every single word is true And I think you need to know So use it as a bookmark Stick it on your refrigerator door Hang it in a picture frame Up above the mantel Where you'll see it for sure Baby, write this down Take a little note To remind you in case you didn't know Yourself, I love you and I don't want you to go Write this down Take my words, read them every day Keep them close by, don't you let them fade away So you remember what I forgot to say Write this down You can find a chisel I can find a stone We'll be reading these words Long after we're gone Baby, write this down Take a little note To remind you in case you didn't know Tell yourself I love you And I don't want you to go Write this down Take my words Read them every day Keep them close by Don't you let them fade away So you remember what I down. Oh, I love you and I don't want you to go. Baby, write this down. iCountry is brought to you by enjoytravel.co.uk music and dancing holidays. And you're very welcome back to part three of iCountry here on Sky 189. Don't forget our Facebook page and our Instagram, iCountry TV. Yes, details on screen as we speak by the powers of modern technology. I love it. Isn't it great? Fierce. 
Yeah, I can just click my fingers and it does that. Yeah, my, yeah. amazing. Anyway, um, we talked last week about a guy called Brian Mullen who won the Sounds Like Country competition in the Bird's Nest mm -hmm. last summer. Well, the previous summer was a guy from Belfast and I'm lucky enough, I was one of the judges for the last few years and um, this guy just came in and he sang in the heat and I, the jaw dropped. I said, this guy is something else. You know, if he doesn't win this competition, now there were some brilliant, fantastic artists in the, you know, competitors in the competition for Sounds Like Country, but this guy was just, he just stood out, mm -hmm. you know, and I don't mean to be disrespectful to anybody else, but um, his name was John Rafferty. Of course. And you probably have heard of John Rafferty. I, my first, my first meeting of John Rafferty was with a CD. I was, uh, I called Carrie Ben for a cup of coffee. Yes. And uh, Carrie said, have you heard of John Rafferty? And I said, no. And she goes, take this CD. I've done the back and vocals along with Leanne. And of course, they recorded with Stephen Smith up yes. in Porta Ferry, a fantastic uh, producer and a great musician and singer. And I put that CD into my car and I did not take it out <laughs> of the CD case, for, well, out of the CD player for weeks. Are you serious? And then I was lucky enough to meet him at Cowboys and Heroes. He took part in the competition there uh, as well. Yeah. Fantastic singer. Well, his prize was to get a single and a video of this next song that you're going to introduce now. Yes, indeed. And of course, here he is, the very same from Belfast, John Rafferty, and his version of Go Rest High on That Mountain. I know your life on earth was trouble and only you know the pain you weren't afraid to face the devil you were no stranger to the rain so go rest high
Yes, indeed, of course, John Rafferty there and his uh, version of Go Rest High on That Mountain, of course, made famous by a well-known American country singer, Vince Gill. Yes, indeed. And that particular year, uh, a guy from County Tyrone called Ryan Hegarty was the runner-up in the competition. And he went on to record this song and this video. Great one, too. It's one called Don't You Ever Get Tired of Hurting Me. You make my eyes run over all the time. You're happy when I'm out of my mind You don't love me but still won't let me be Don't you ever get tired I look back with a smile For you have let me wear one In such a long, long while Still I keep running back Why must this be? unique voice, real authentic country sound to this guy, uh, Ryan Hegarty, and don't you ever get tired of hurting me. Who's the blonde in that video there? Who's the blonde? Why? She's a fine bit of stuff, isn't she? Oh gosh, she's all right. I've seen her knocking about Sligo. Oh, she's very lucky. She's married to me. Oh, that's the lovely funny. Sinead. That's the lovely it Sinead. Is, it is. And if you're watching Sinead, well done on your acting. Well done. Onwards and upwards. Onwards and upwards. We're moving on with a lady from County Tyrone. Her name is Shauna McStravick. And down at the twist and shout. Saturday night. i 
the show They got hurricane parties every time it blows well, here up north it's a cold, cold rain And there ain't no kill from my blues today Except when the paper says Beausoleil Is it coming into town, baby, let's go down It's Saturday night and the moon is out I wanna head on over to the twist and shout Find a twist and partner and a Cajun beat When it lifts me up, I'm gonna find my feet Country is brought to you by enjoytravel.co.uk music and dancing holidays. Welcome back to part four of today's iCountry and hopefully you're enjoying the program. We're bringing some great videos from the Irish country music scene and uh, as I said some of the well-known and some of the less well-known. That's right. You know this next guy he um, you were talking about trucks earlier, mm -hmm. and he's got an absolutely brilliant video. It's a, it's a great song. It's a guy called Daniel Byrne. Oh, great song. I love you know that song. one there? Yeah. So, if the junction's empty, give her plenty. <laughs> if the junction's empty, give her plenty. If there's no one coming, give her a shoe. Daniel Byrne there, and if the junction's empty, give her plenty. 
great catchy song, isn't it? Great catchy song. I love the name of it. You know, if, you, if the junction's empty, you have her plenty. <laughs> Monaghan this time? Monaghan this time, yes. A young man by the name of Aidan Clerken. And uh, Aidan is very busy on the social dancing scene. I've seen him in action a few times in the Glencairn Hotel in Castle Blaney. You're going to enjoy this one. Smiles been upside down You're too pretty to be wearing that frown I know a way to turn it right side up Let me show you how we're gonna get that done A little more loving and a lot more fun That kind of stuff you can never have enough When the sun goes down, gonna get out of town Girl, get ready, I'm picking you up I'll wash down the bed in my pickup truck we might break down or we could get stuck Good Lord willing and a little bit of luck A Good Lord willing and a little bit of luck Dawn to go right down Route 16 Get a little sugar up the Dairy Queen We'll hang left where the driving used to be Spinning our wheels down a rear dirt road We can go anywhere when there's nowhere to go just us three, you and the moon and me Drive real fast, we're gonna run out of gas Girl, get ready, I'm picking you up I'll wash out the bed in my pickup truck We might break down or we could get stuck Good Lord willing and a little bit of luck Good Lord willing and a little bit of luck And your blue jeans on I'll get you going You were gonna get gone Ain't coming back Until the break of dawn One minute more Till I knock on your door Girl, get ready I'm picking you up I'll wash down the bed In my pickup truck We might break down Or we could get stuck Good Lord willing And a little bit of luck Good Lord willing And a little bit of luck Good Lord willing And a little bit of luck Good Lord willing And a little bit of luck Yes, indeed, of course, Aidan Clerken there and his version of A Little Bit of Luck. And Aidan was one of the team of singers that joined us for The Meaning of Christmas, the charity Christmas single for Temple Street Children's Hospital, which uh, raised a lot of money. That was a great idea and a great cause. Yeah, it was a guy called Ger Long Fair came up one. with the idea. He's and County Loud, isn't he? He is Carlingford man. We must feature him on the show. Yeah, we will indeed. Definitely. And uh, we were sitting after a gig in Liston Varna during, uh, in September, and uh, Ger was just chatting about this idea that he came up with for a, a charity Christmas single. Great and idea. he managed to get, uh, you know, 30 people on board and sponsors on board. And it was a terrific success and uh, well done to Ger. And um, as I said, plans in the pipeline for next year. So looking forward to that already. That's great. Well, not next year, this year. This year, of yeah, course, yeah. yeah. When you think of it. Yeah, that's true. It's going to come around. We're coming to the end of the show, Brendan. Yes, indeed. And uh, hopefully you've enjoyed the music. We've certainly enjoyed bringing the show as usual. And uh, young lady from County Tyrone to finish us off. Cleona Hagen or Hagen? Hagen. Hagen, isn't it? I think. Yeah. Depends well, on that's what she from. calls herself. Okay, that's enough. If it's good enough for her, it's good enough for us. That's it. Yeah. And this is a song from Cleonis One Call. There's more where that came from. So, until the next time, from me, Brendan McGee. And myself, Gerald Butler. Bye bye now. Take care. And happy Valentine's Day. I've been through hell and half Louisiana looking for a man like you. I know you could have any woman you want. I know you could have a few. Oh, I know I've got some stiff competition. Nothing on me Cause I've got something that you've been missing I practice what I preach Cause I wanna be your lover I wanna be your friend I wanna be your full-time woman Closer than your 
your friend Oh, I wanna be your full-time woman I'm gonna get under your skin Cause I wanna be your satisfaction 